Hey, baby, I'm home. Hey there, beautiful. Good to see you. I'm good. Nothing too exciting today, which is fine by me. You know I enjoy a good boring day at work. <laughs> How about you? How are you doing? Fine. Just fine? Anything you want to talk about? Now, what's that shrug for? Hey, come here. Yeah, come sit on the bed and talk to me for a second. Did something happen today, or is it just one of those days? Just one of those days. All right, I understand that. I get those days too. Well, here, why don't you just lay against me, and I'll put my arm around you, and we'll figure this out together. Ah, there you go. It's okay, baby. I've got you. Hey, baby. I thought you were going out with your friends later. What do you mean you were supposed to? What happened? Mm hmm. You're not sure if you want to go. How come? You're not sure what to wear. I see. Well, baby, look at me. Now, stop me if anything I'm saying is wrong, but I know that sometimes you get a bit stressed out going out because you feel insecure about your looks or your body or what you're wearing. Is that what's going on? Okay. Hey, hey, it's all right. I just want to make sure I'm understanding things correctly. Like I've told you, I just want to do whatever I can to make my girl feel better, okay? So, I want you to listen to me. First off, you have nothing to be embarrassed about. We all have these days where we feel a little bit insecure, and it can be really, really hard to deal with, especially if you're trying to deal with it by yourself. But I'm right here, and I know that you are lovely, and I think we can work through this together. So, I want you to just relax and listen to me while I rub your back like this. You have nothing to be insecure about. I spent so much time just looking at you and thinking about how pretty you are, and I hate that you ever have a day where you doubt that. I want you to remember that just because a thought exists does not mean it's true. Your thoughts are just a reflection of how you feel, and usually the person we're most critical towards is ourselves. That's why sometimes we look at other people and we just assume they view us in a negative way because we're viewing ourselves in a negative way. So right now, don't focus on what your head is telling you. Just listen to what I'm telling you. I think you are beautiful. I think every part of you is perfect, just as it is. There is nothing you have to change to be more beautiful. The only time you should be changing anything about the way you look is if it would make you happy, okay? So, if you want to try a different style of clothes or a different haircut or whatever else you want to do, we can do that. But none of that could ever change the fact that you are a lovely person with a perfect body and you have no reason to be insecure. Here, let's try something. I'm going to sit on the edge of the bed, and I just want you to stand right in front of me. Yeah, just trust me. That's it. Just like that. Now, I am going to tell you all the things I like about you. Starting with how much I like your hair, 
and how much I like it when you style it all fancy, and how I still like it when your hair is messy first thing in the morning. I like when you talk about maybe trying some crazy new hairstyle or new color, because I love seeing you get excited about things. I love your eyes. I love the way they look when you smile at me. I love your neck. I love kissing up and down it when we're laying next to each other. That's it, baby. Just relax. Just relax as I run my fingers over every part of you, baby girl. That's it. That's my pretty girl. I love your arms. I love the feeling when you wrap them around me. I love your fingers. I love feeling them brush the hair out of my face before you give me a kiss. <laughs> I love holding your hand when we walk. I love your back. I love the way it looks when we're in the shower together and you're in front of me. And I'm kissing your shoulders and helping you relax. Oh, my pretty girl. I love your stomach. I love every curve you have. And I know sometimes you feel like one part of you is too big or another part of you is too small. But I'm telling you, every single curve and angle of your body is just right. It's just perfect how it is, and you don't need to be ashamed of anything. And you know I love your thighs and your legs, and I love getting to lay on your lap while you play with my hair. I love your feet and when you get your nails done and you're so excited to show me. <laughs> I wish you could see yourself the way that I see you, baby girl. I think if you could see how I see you and how all your friends see you, you would feel much less insecure. So, why don't you come sit on my lap? Oh, there we go. It will just take a few more minutes to relax together. And then you can get ready to see your friends, okay? Okay. And you just lay your head against my chest for a bit. There you go. That's my good girl. How do you feel, baby? A little better? I know it can be hard to believe anything good when you're feeling down like this, but we'll keep working on it, okay? All right. I've got you. You know what? How about this weekend I take you out shopping? We can get you some new clothes that might help you feel a bit more confident. But we're only going on one condition. We're not going to look at sizes or worry about that at all. All that matters is finding clothes that make you feel comfortable and pretty, alright? I know you can get a little bit fixated on sizes, which isn't fair to yourself because... You know every fashion company has different sizing, right? So that's why one pair of jeans fits fine, but then the next one fits terribly, even though it says it's the same size. I know, I know, it's ridiculous. So we're just going to focus on finding clothes that gets you excited and makes you feel pretty, and we will keep trying on stuff until we've got a few new outfits for your closet. How does that sound, baby girl? All right, good. Oh, it's the least I could do, sweetheart. You know I just want you to be okay, baby. I just want you to feel pretty all the time and realize just how special you are. Mm. Mm. Well, and I hope you know that you are doing such a good job. I'm really, really proud of you, baby. 
I know it's not easy getting through days like this, but I promise you are doing amazing. Everything is going to be okay, baby girl.